And we're back. And we're running. We're running. We're running. No, we're not. We're jumping and kicking. Ow. Seriously, those sword guys do a lot of damage. Nope. Get off. So thankful for Donnie's reach. Yeah. 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 Come on. Here. Have some fireworks. Gotcha. There we go. There we go. Alright. Slowly figuring out that slam move. I thought it was like holding and tapping the button, but it just you just get up to him and start tapping him when you're at your shoulders. And... Yeah, I knew that picture was a trap. Just looking at that ugly face was a trap. Alright, let's get that before anything bad happens and I regret it. Okay. Yeah, aren't those star thrower guys? I hate them. I think those... Ah! Oh, whoa. Forgot I could do that. That was a freaky button mash. Does it take energy in this game? Yes, it does. I will... Nope, not to do that unless of under distress. Get out of here. I think those weird planks with the X's on them. That's the ones I want to avoid so they don't slam up in my face. I think the pirate ship on the uh, Turtles in Time had something like that. Yeah. There we go. Moving right along here. Yeah, on the subject of the Donatello, um, the guy who voiced him, Barry Gordon, um, I, I got to actually talk to him twice. Um, I went on uh, the one day to get my own autograph, and then I decided to come back the next day and get an autograph for my brother, since Donnie was his favorite turtle, you know, as a kid growing up, so, and, uh, and he remembered me, and he was very, uh, he was very touched by that, that, you know, I came back for him twice so I could, uh, get an autograph for my brother, and he appreciated that, and he was, he's a really swell guy, too, and his corner wasn't always busy, you know, he was kind of like, uh, sort of the least unpopular one, I guess. I don't know. Um, not saying that people didn't love him, you know, there was people there, but to each their own. And, um, oh shit. Stone soldiers. I need a spice. But yeah, he was a cool guy, and uh, it's funny, every time I heard the voice actors talk, I could, I could hear a little bit of the turtle still inside them, right? And it was so weird listening to them talk, because they talk like normal people, right? I mean, the only one you couldn't really tell that was Leo was Ken Clark, because he has so many voices, right? He sounds so different, you know, in his normal voice. But the rest of them, you could definitely hear it. And um, I can't remember the guy's name who played uh, Raph. Rob Paulson, I think it was. And um, he, for those of you who don't know, he plays Donnie in the new TMNT uh, that comes on Saturday mornings, and it's so funny hearing his voice, I was, I was with my daughter, uh, seeing him, and, um, uh, she's looking at him, and I'm talking to him, and, uh, she's wearing a, a t-shirt that my brother got her with the four turtles on, the four new ones for the new show, and, um, and he looks down at her, and he goes, I like your shirt, and says, you see that guy there? I voiced this guy, and, his, and then he starts doing the voice of Donnie for the new show, and uh, my girl, she looks up, and she just she kind of perks her eyes, like, what the? Like, I've heard that before, but he's talking just like him. Inconceivable! So, um, yeah, Estelise was pretty enthralled with that. That was pretty cool to watch. So, lots of, ow, you sack of crap. Lots of Comic-Con memories. Hopefully I'll remember most of that stuff until I get, you know, Alzheimer's in my 70s or whatever, so. Boom, 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 boom. Oops. Oh, there was a trick to these guys. Yeah, that's it. They had those stupid blocker things. There we go. The lag of tight to might. Is that a tight or a might? I'm not sure. I have to wiki that shit. Yeah. 
There we go. That's the best way to get rid of him. Come on. Grab his shoulder. Or not. Just keep doing that until the cows come home, I guess. Yeah. Spike save power. Whoa, is that guy going? Whoa, yeah, he does. He's got a rocket launcher. Good old RPG there. Ah, freaking star throwers. Those things are so tiny, I barely see them coming. Boom. Whoa, didn't mean to flip over you. Uh, oh right, Mr. Rocksteady. I don't remember Bebop being in this game, but I've been proven wrong before. Let's see if I remember how to do this guy. All these patterns are fairly simple, right? Oh yeah, 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 okay. At least you get a very high jump in this. Wee. 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 And look at Rocksteady's eyes. Looks like he saw a ghost on that ship or something. Looks kind of freaked out. Oh, I'll grab the pizza while I'm here. Get that extra point for points, I guess. Fall on your bum. Uh, remember, when I see you next time, I'll beat you. Funny enough, he does see me next time, like in a later level. Yay. Scene 3, Shredder's Hideout, which is surprisingly not the Technodrome yet. I forget if the Technodrome is in this game or not. Yeah, I always forget about that noise. I'm like, what the hell is that? Expecting some ninja to come out. Whoa. Come on. Whoa! Eh. There we go. Stupid little things. I love it how the uh, the standard foot soldier is red in this game, whereas in most Turtles games the standard foot soldier comes across as purple. But purple ones in this, they are uh, not standard. They throw those stupid stars, and I hate them. And stop moving. How do I get that shoulder slam going? I'm having trouble getting it going. Well, I'll just check you. I guess that works. Whoa. Almost ran into that one there. There we go. Love that reach, Don. Keep that reach a going. Nice little bonsai tree. Whoa, barbecue soldiers. Forgot about those guys. Are these nunchaku guys? Yeah, they look like it. Boom. That tile must be heavy for you to carry. That's why I sent it back to you. I don't think Shredder's gonna like you putting holes in his walkway. Eh. Oh, freaking swordman! Eh, 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 eh. Okay. Well, that didn't exactly work, but whatever. Can I break these? No, I thought I could for some reason. There we go. Uh, yeah. Do a little touch up there. Ow. It hit me. Mousers! No, 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 no! Not the freaking Mousers! Not last time when they knocked me off the damn thing. Or was that a foot soldier? No, it was a foot soldier. Let's take it up. Ah! Level 7 in that ah, nest game. There. Freaking piece of crap. I'd say somebody should call an exterminator on those things, but it's uh, kind of how they came about to be. So maybe it would be irony that somebody called an exterminator on the mousers. Bing, bing, bing. Ugh, candle! Yeah. Eat that, candle. Candle was no match to my bow staff. There we go. Uh, oh right, can't jump. I thought those things came. Whoa, no, I just said, I just said, 
can't jump. Oh, son of a... Okay, now I see the point of this. Making it hard for me here. That's fine, that's fine. I can handle a little challenge. Slam your face in. Whoa. Okay. Kunai guys, I guess? Oh, crap, crap, crap. I jump kicked right into that. That was stupid. Oh, man. I hope this isn't like some kind of dojo Shredder has set up here. That would be sick. Actually, I remember in the uh, TMNT, what was it called, arcade game for the NES? Um, the freaking bonus level, quote-unquote, as it was. The levels that were not included in the actual arcade game, but added to the NES game. Um, the second one inside the level like this had freaking scorpion robots or something? There was something that shot out of the ground. I forget what it was. If it was a spike? For some reason, I remember a snake. It wasn't a snake. Oh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking of... Uh, the level in Scott Pilgrim. See, I'm, I'm talking gibberish right now because my mind is process, processing a hundred things at once and I'm not making any damn sense. So now I'm talking about turtles, dojo levels, and Scott Pilgrim. So. Oh, fucking mouse, yes. Get off! Oh my, get off! You sack of crap! You sacks of crap! I hate Mousers. I should probably jump with them more often, but where they're gonna smack me out of the air. Like some dill hole that they are. Yeah, these things shoot lasers, I think. Yeah, they do. Uh, ow! Yeah. I was afraid I was gonna do that. I thought I could make it to a pizza, but that is a no sir go. There we go. Okay, stop shooting your damn lasers. There's my fucking pizza. That's fantastic. That is just great. Oh, that... Oh, man, I'm crispy. Well, at least I got the life back, but still. Ah, let go! There we go. Oh, Krispies. Krispies! Yeah. Boom. Boom. Suck it. Oh, door time already. Alright, let's see what we got here. Alright. Oh, Holy crap! It's Octo Shredder. You must defeat my foot soldiers before you fight me. Yeah, I don't think so, Tetsu. I remember as a kid fighting, thinking, oh, okay, you gotta fight his foot soldiers before he wants to fight, right? Yeah, no. He just keeps sending them over and over and over. So you just gotta break his code of ethics. Otherwise, you'll just be at this forever, so. This kid doesn't send anything harder than this. I can set those knives back to him if I stand close enough, but... Whoa, 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 hey, hey, hey. But I'd rather just run over there and go greet the bald bastard myself. Ah, let go, let go! Idiot. I'm racking up points, anyways. There we go. Look at him inch over. He's like, eh, wiggy, 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 wiggy. Master dot 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 exclamation mark and quotations. Ah, oh, secret passageway. Who would have thunk it? Whoop, whoop. All right. The Gauntlet. Oh, yeah, right. That's okay. Well, next time I will do the Gauntlet. And, um, this doesn't look like a Gauntlet. It looks like a cave. Yeah.